Well, hello everyone. Philosopher Stoner 666 here. Well, not 666. I want to change my name, but I still haven't come up with a better name. So it stays that name for now until I think of something better and figure out how to change it. So anyway, um, Don Cherry, who was a uh, sports caster guy on TV, um, I, just pr to preface this, this rant, I'm not a fan of his. I don't like him. I have his flamboyant suits and his obnoxious personality, and I don't like sports, and I don't watch Sportsnet. Anyway, this guy, Don Cherry, famous Canadian figure, um, sportscaster, announcer, uh, got fired for making what people claim were racist comments. He used the term, you people, and told people that if they, I'm badly paraphrasing here, but told people that if you're not wearing a poppy, you know, you're not honoring the veterans, that sort of thing. It doesn't even really matter what he said. But anyways, everybody's going on, okay, this guy's right to free speech, free speech, free speech. And okay, I believe in free speech as well. But the thing is, is what people don't realize is that we give away our free speech all the time. Like, look at what's happened on YouTube. Everything is about making money and advertising dollars. So you run a network, like a sports news thing, you want your rhetoric on that sports news site or whatever to be middle of the road, don't rock the boat, appeal to the lowest common denominator as possible, and keep the sensitive topics and political opinions to yourself on that, again, to reach a mass audience and get what? Advertising dollars. So while there is certainly free speech, free speech is a it's a legit issue in this case. There's no freedom from consequences, and the consequences are if you work for someone else, you sort of give away your free speech, speech rights. You give away your freedom because you're working for someone else and you're dependent on advertising dollars. So when advertising dollars and all these special interests get involved, especially in the media, there is no free speech. Free speech is a fiction but nobody cares because everybody wants to make money and it's all about those that precious advertising dollar. Uh, we essentially give away our own free speech. There are, there are no real in, in rights in that sense. Like I have freedom of speech, I can go on the soapbox on the street and say what I want and no one's really gonna give a shit. But when, once, like I said, once you start working for someone else and they pay you and the revenue that they get is comes from advertising dollars. Advertising dollars are gotten from, like I said, having a network or a show or a program or whatever that is lowest common denominator, does not rock the boat, reaches as mass an audience as possible so that the ads can sell stuff to people. It's about making money and selling stuff. Um, nobody, like I said, they don't want to hear anything that's going to rock the boat. And that, to me, no one's really getting that. Um, so if, like I said, if you sell out, you work for someone else, you get paid money, um, and they tell you what to say, you just say what they say. And like I said, it's about getting that money, getting that advertising dollars. That's, that's what it's all about. That's all. That's my only comment on this issue. I know I'm a little late in the game. I don't get on these things right away when they happen, but I'm looking at a lot of opinion pieces about this, and... Uh, you know, on the internet, and newspapers, etc. To everybody, it's talk, saying the same sort of stuff, and it's like they don't understand the fundamentals of the game. Once you get advertisers involved, there is no more free speech. It's like I said, it's about making money. It's not about anybody's free speech at that point, um, and that's how it works. So, don't work for someone else. Don't sell out. Don't be dependent on ads, and you can maintain your free speech. But once you do that, yeah, it's sort of gone out the window. Um, anyways, that's just my two cents. Well, shit, we don't even have cents anymore. Well, that's my uh, two dimes worth of an opinion. Um, that's all I wanted to say. Philosopher Stoner 666, out.